students so hope you would have seen the earlier video students i've taught you what is meant by uh, eclipsed confirmation staggered confirmation that is in like newman projection as well as <coughs> you know i thought you saw horse everything clearly explained right so now in this video we'll be learning about the concept of torsional strain and we'll also be drawing the newman projection confirmations as well as saw horse for the ethane molecule at different different angles done so when i have to speak about the concept of torsional strain just see so torsional strain is nothing but a resistance because of the rep uh, repulsion existing between adjacent carbon atoms done so first let us write the definition what is torsional strain it is it is right definition the resistance to twisting which affects the stability of conformations is called torsional strain right and one more concept which is related to the torsional strain is torsional energy let us write that torsional energy so what is this i said because of the repulsion resistance to repulsion that means that restricted molecule that strict i said this is uh, energy difference of 1 to 20 kilojoules that little because of uh, repulsion between electronic repulsions because of that the torsion strain is created and the energy which is required in restriction is called torsional energy okay let us write energy required in restriction is called torsional energy one word right we have also seen in the previous video what is that dihedral angle one more word which i have to to uh, give you a definition is dihedral angle so what do we see dihedral angle i said the angle means uh, when i take a molecule like uh, Listen, let us draw that example and see same, same thing i am drawing one i have taken staggered conformation in this one okay. one hydrogen here one more hydrogen here one more hydrogen one hydrogen sec next and one more now i said the angle between these two is called dihedral angle how will we define this right so same thing the angle between adjacent uh, hydrogen atoms present is called dihedral angle right so this dihedral angle or the magnitude of this so on what basis does it depend important thing why did i draw here because the magnitude of the torsion strain depends on the rotation about carbon carbon bond so the dihedral angle because it denoted by theta what am i trying to explain i'm explaining the magnitude or the measure of torsional strain depends on theta dihedral angle around or about carbon carbon bond carbon carbon bond so among of the staggered and eclipsed what we have seen staggered form has least torsional strain i said the repulsion is very minimum isn't it in staggered so among both the forms when i have to see staggered form has least torsional strain right and when an eclipsed form as i said because the atoms are very close isn't it as i've shown in the previous video so eclipsed form has maximum torsional strain so what is the energy difference between both the energy difference is between both is 12.5 kilojoules per mole now let us answer one question suppose if your teacher is asking you why is it not possible to separate or isolate conformational isomers of ethane why can't i separate we we have written isn't it then non separable so if, we, if the teacher is asking you this question let's see why is it not possible to separate or isolate 
different conformational isomers conformational isomers of ethane if they ask if the teacher ask why, why can't you separate them so simple answer which you have to write directly just you need to mention the keywords important thing is we said the energy difference is very less isn't it 12.5 so because energy difference is very very small very less in ethane molecule even at ordinary temperature like normal ordinary temperature right so they gain thermal energy or kinetic energy that kinetic energy why how do they gain because of intermolecular collisions that's why because of this the energy difference is easily they can uh, their uh, interconvertible isn't it so because of this they gain kinetic energy they get interconvertible when they get interconvertible can i separate them i can't separate them so that is the reason they, we can't separate both the isomers let us write since energy difference is small between both small and small between two conformers how much is energy difference i said 12.5 kilojoules per mole only done so what will happen even at ordinary temperatures even at ordinary temperature what do they gain they gain which energy as i said they gain thermal energy they gain thermal or kinetic energy easily isn't it how do they gain the thermal or kinetic energy due to intermolecular collisions intermolecular collisions so once they gain easily i think you know they can um, it's once they get converted it's very difficult for us to separate with very less energy isn't it right so because of the intermolecular collisions they uh, they get interconvertible and we can't separate them uh, easily that so i think uh, with this the concept of torsion strain dihedral angle torsion energy and uh, is clear students now let us come back and draw the conformers of ethane conformers of propane or the conformations of propane uh, in terms of newman projection sofas projection and see how are we drawing it means how are we showing it what happens when we rotate it to 60 degree what happens when we rotate it to uh, 120 degree 180 degree like that thank you for watching students i'll meet you in my next video with the conformations stay connected stay tuned